snowfall is expected to have an impact on your morning commute. Our Carrie Larson talked to the State Highway Patrol and the Madison Streets Division. She joins us live from the Beltline with their words of advice tonight. Hi, Carrie. Hi, Leah. I'm standing next to the Beltline near the Verona Road exit where, as you can see, the snow is starting to come down. Local emergency officials I spoke with earlier today say that drivers need to be cautious with the potential for hazardous road conditions. And the uh, Madison Streets Division is hoping to help with that. They say 32 snow plows will be out helping to clean up the area streets. This is Wisconsin, so you, you have to be prepared for whatever Mother Nature throws our way. Living in Wisconsin, we know an early sign of spring is usually followed by more of this. A March snow like this isn't exactly unheard of here. But snow emergency crews say they're ready no matter what. As you can see behind me and around me, our plows are ready, the salt spreaders are on, we've got plenty of material on hand. As soon as the snow hits, Madison plows will treat the busier roads. Then when it starts to slow down, they'll move to the residential areas. Well, the streets division's policy is that we wait till the storm is at or near its end. And there has to be three more inches of snow accumulated on the roads before we go out and plow everything. Until that happens, though, drivers need to be cautious. I would recommend traveling beforehand or traveling afterwards. That way, it gives the highway crews and us more time to prepare. Trooper Su Shang says he responds to several more calls when bad weather hits. People think that they can go a little faster or they get caught off guard with the nice weather. All of a sudden it, it, it turns to snow or rain and they're not prepared and, and we get a lot of people crashing or, or running off the road. So those snow pods will be out throughout this entire snow event, again, hitting those busier streets all day tomorrow and then hitting those residential streets sometime tomorrow evening. And also, Leo, want to mention that if drivers do find themselves needing assistance on the side of the highway, they're asked to call 911 and a dispatcher will get them in touch with the Wisconsin State um, Troopers and they will send somebody out to help. All right, our Carrie Larson reporting live tonight. Thanks, Carrie.